Long wait times and not enough help. This might sound familiar if you've tried to get a real ID. Now there are plans to change that. News 4's Cameron Taylor is live outside one of Nashville's busy driver's license centers right now. Cameron, you spoke with people who had to deal with a five hour wait. Yeah, that's what a couple of people told us, Tom and Tracy. So five hours, that's enough time to drive from Nashville to Asheville, North Carolina. And tonight the state says they want to hire more people to help with this problem. Lisa Lindsay thought an hour would be enough time to get a real ID. She found out quickly it wasn't. Walked in, there are so many people already waiting. I, I knew it wasn't really going to happen. The state started issuing real IDs in July. You'll need that to fly domestically without a passport next year. Since launching Real ID, wait times haven't been pretty. I don't know if more staff or a different process uh, is going to be what it takes, but there's certainly a problem in there, and, and it seems completely unacceptable. Andrew Flanagan went to this driver services center on Hart Lane in Nashville. He needed to renew his commercial driver's license. And I just successfully got my renewal. Uh, and the time stamp on that is 4.05, so I'm just shy of five hours I spent here today. We took the concerns to Paula Shaw, who is the Assistant Commissioner of Driver Services. That's under the Department of Safety and Homeland Security in Tennessee. It saddens me, it really does. I, it's, we're all in a, a position where um, we understand that it's, it's, it's difficult for them. Shaw wants to add 80 more employees to help with wait times. They would go to the busiest centers in the state, including Hart Lane. It's an idea Lindsay can get behind. With the influx of people moving to Nashville, I don't see any other way to be able to do it. Now, Shaw says 29 people have already been hired temporarily, and she also tells us the hope is to keep them as part of the 80 she wants to bring on board. Of course, the governor will have the final say as he goes over the budget. Tom Tracy. I got my real ID. Took about three hours, Cameron. Thanks for the live report.